This is now going into product marketplace territory. What they're doing is they're really tightening that, that checkout process because honestly, I mean, I have bought stuff, but it's a very clunky process. So this is cool. Instagram wants hackers to go after its new shopping feature. So what you've kind of seen, like Instagram has been tinkering with this. Instagram platform type is content platform, right? It's a one-to-many. It's a maker model. I post a photo or a video. I want millions and millions and millions of people to uh, like or engage with that single piece of content. This is now going into product marketplace territory. This is this checkout feature. And they've been doing stuff in the past where you could you know, tag something and buy it. But now what they're doing is they're really tightening that, that checkout process. Because honestly, I mean, I have bought stuff off of stuff I've seen on Instagram, but it's a very clunky process. What Instagram, I think they're doing here is saying, we're gonna have a profile for you, Alex. I'm gonna store your credit card and payment information. And now you're gonna buy, you're gonna be able to buy products purely within the Instagram experience. Right now, I would need to go to these other websites, enter in my credit card information, you know, create an account, all this kind of stuff. So think about this as just really streamlining this. They've seen a lot of success, even with a very, not broken, but a very kind of arduous checkout process. It's not streamlined as it could nearly be. So now they're streamlining it. And I think this is gonna be a very big deal um, for Instagram's just overall economic profile. And now what you're seeing, here's the cool thing, right? So as I was talking about before, tech monopolies are just massive new platform incubation engines. Not only has Facebook stacked Instagram on top of Facebook, Facebook's kind of platform conglomerate. Now they're stacking a platform type product marketplace on top of Instagram on top of the kind of like subsidiary content platform. They're stacking platform on top of platform on top of platform. It's a thing of beauty. And I think this is gonna, this is gonna crush. Hi, this is Alex Mozed. Thanks for joining us on Winner Take All. If you enjoyed the content today, which I bet you did, please comment, subscribe, and definitely message me on Twitter when we're doing live streams. Also, please note, all opinions expressed about stocks or public companies on the show are exactly that, opinions. This is not investment advice. Don't act on it. Wisdom Tree licensed Applico's Platform Insights data product to aid in the creation of the Plat ETF. Thanks for joining us.